What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs. And yes, guys, today I want to go over the most, not the most, I'm an idiot, the best budget cards in MLB The Show 19. Not budget card. I'm just going over left fielders in this video because there are so many budgets left fielders. Oh, my God. Let's get into them. This is... You guys have to see how many budget outfielders there are. God, if you guys didn't check out my last budget video, some stub making videos and stuff, go check it out. Um, oh my god. Okay, let's get into the left fielders. Okay, so out of the golds, the golds right here are. I know. Let's just go to field. Let's just go to eighty four for now. Okay. So Okuna, I own him. I'm. He's the gold man. I love that guy, man. Okay, so Tommy Pham starting off. We're gonna start off with Okuna. He's not budget, but you guys know. You know what Okuna does. He does big things. He's gonna be a diamond. Hundred percent gonna be a diamond. Pick him up if you have the stubs. But okay, so the first one we got Tommy Pham. Very, very, very good stats. Awesome stats. Very cheap. I don't know if I would recommend because his vision's low, but. He's very good stats. If you guys freak with him, I don't like him that much. I, eh, I have better options, but he's all right. Ozuna, I like Ozuna a lot. He has very good, well-rounded stats. Power, contact, the speed's there, the vision's there, arm strength's there. He's just all around, literally all around perfect. Very budget, awesome. So he's my one of my top gold options. Hold on. Yes, I'm a. Uh, uh, we got Ben Attendee, man. The stats don't say it, but I can tell you guys that this guy is a god, guys. I'm not kidding. The stat, he just, he's just, his. I don't know how his batting is bronze because he hit 300 last year with like 20 to 30 something home runs. Just amazing. He plays so good. His vision's good too. This card, I honestly think he's going to be a diamond. I, there's no way he's not going to be a diamond. Benz Hendy is so freaking good. He's literally he was a top 10 fantasy player last year. He's so freaking good. So, out of the golds, oh my god. I just saw Juan Soto and I freaked out. Guys, Juan Soto, everyone cop him. He's going to be a diamond. He's literally going to be our generational player. Juan Soto is unbelievable. A complete ath complete freak athlete. Go amazing beast. Okay. Cespedes, injured for a little bit. Coming back, awesome player to have. Awesome, awesome, awesome budget outfielder. Cespedes was diamond last year. He's 2K right now. How? I don't know. So, ready? My top three gold players right here. I'm going to go Juan Soto because he's just amazing. He's just a stud. Juan Soto, Yoannis Cespedes, then Ben Attendi. Then, uh, if there's a fourth, I would say Ozuna. So, those are my top four right here. So, let's get into the silvers. Ready? Okay. Michael Brantley, one of the best contact hitters in the game, super cheap, uh, extremely cheap. He's literally, he had a great, I'm so happy for this guy. Awesome bounce back season, awesome, good for him, man. The vision's there, the contact's there, the speed for some reason isn't there. But man, this guy's an all-around beast, man. Contact, feeling's good, strength's good. He's, he's a beautiful card, very good silver card. Joey Gal overpriced, his power is just... Like, it's crazy. He, he can't... Okay, first of all, how is his power against lefties good? He cannot hit lefties for his life. And his vision's trash, so he's not even budget, so it's not a good card. Can you stop? I'm recording! Oh, my God. No! Oh, my God. So, I'm sorry about that, guys. My mom's just being annoying. Um. So... Oh, my God. Okay, so we got Gallo, Powers there. Everything else isn't not budget. If you want them, I guess. I don't know. Um, so we got McCutcheon. Um, we got McCutcheon. So, you know, it's just McCutcheon. I just have to give him respect. I think he's good. His, I like his stance, but I don't think he's one of the top budget silvers. I really don't give it to him. Brett Gardner, if you guys like speed, this is the man for you. The vision's there, too. I don't know if he's going to get on base. His, his hitting stats are just terrible. Will Myers, okay. The stats are not there once again, but 
if he could turn into a gold, keep your eyes on him. Chris Davis, okay. The power's there, the vision's there, everything else isn't. I can't qualify him as good. I guess he's a good pitch hitter. He has the, he has the power. Okay, David Dahl. This card is beautiful, okay? I'm going to tell you why. The contact is perfect. The power is okay. It's a little low. The vision is decent. The speed's decent. The speed's pretty good, actually. Very. It's 73 speed's very good. Very good. Fielding's there. It's okay. Not really the best. Arm strength's okay. Not really the best. So he's all around good. I respect this card. He's perfect, honestly. Ryan Braun. Ryan Braun. Um, he's all right. I guess he's a good hitter. That's it. Corey Dickerson, very good card. I like him. Like he's just very good. He's got to be a gold man. He's so underrated. He's got to be a gold. He's just a good player all around. He's a great all around player to have. Awesome left fielder. I respect him. Matt Kemp. Oh my god, I love Matt Kemp. This is a very good card too. He has contact and power. Vision's there. Also, pretty good arm strength. Slow as hell for some reason. He's not even slow. But awesome card. I'm definitely putting this in my top three. One of my top three cards. Justin Upton, man. Whew, he's been around forever. I love Justin Upton, man. Awesome power. Awesome. Eh, all, pretty good power. Not Pretty good contact. The vision is terrible. I love Upton. Maybe he'll do good again this season and get gold, but we'll see. Jock Pedersen. Uh, eh, nah, trash. Nah. I mean, the only thing he's good is against righties for power. That's it. I don't respect that. Schwarber got some power. Really good arm strength. Really good fielding. Wow. They gave Schwarber good fielding in left field. That blows my mind. This card's crazy. Wow. Okay. So Schwarber's very good. Duvall. Wow. They botched Duvall's power. Very disrespectful. All right. So for my silvers, I will go as my top cards. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Michael Brantley at number one. Just because I just... He's just so good. He's going to be a gold. I know he's going to be a gold. Number one, him. Will Meyer. Uh, I would say David Dahl, number two. David Dahl, number two. And Matt Kemp, number three. Those are my... And Schwarber, number four. If I if I had number four. Schwarber, amazing card. Look at those. Look at that power. All right. So, let's get into the bronzes. Okay. All right. Okay. Sin Su Chu. Yeah. Perfect bronze card, all around, all around good, all around fifty or above. It's perfect, decent bronze card. Okay, Jamie Wicker and Domingo Santana, very good hitter. I have to say, if you have seventy and above on three, that's very good. It's a bronze card, very good. Ichiro, let's check it. Let's see Ichiro. Ooh, they this card's terrible. Don't buy this card. That's terrible. Wow. Matt Joyce, trash, trash, trash. So right now, Sinsu Chu, Domingo, looking nice. Oh, baby. Look at this Tyler O'Neill card right here. Oh, my. My phone is getting spammed. Like, who are... Stop. So right here. Got Tyler O'Neill. Beautiful card for bronze. Because you know why? He has perfect power. He just, he's just an all-around beast, and he has the speed, which makes him a stud. He's definitely in my top three, 100%. Uh, Robbie Grossman, uh, nah. Trey Mancini, nah. Let's see. Okay. Oh my God, T. Oscar Hernandez, big breakout candidate. Did decent last year. Highly recommend the card. He is in my top three. I he's gonna break out. He's gonna be a silver, hundred percent guaranteed. I'm not. I know he is. He's he's amazing. He's very talented. I like him. He's very good. So. Honestly, the rest of the bronze cards are honestly really, really trash. This guy's okay. Let's see what else we got. Good speedster right here. This isn't even bronze cards. I'm not even looking at the comments. So, ready? My top three for bronze, I would say. For the bronze cards, my top three, we got Domingo Father, because he's just all around beast. Sinsu Chu, O'Neal. And last but not least, Tiasco Hernandez. That's my top four, I would say. Tiasco Hernandez. If you guys need fielding, it's no point. But Alex Gordon's good too. But those are my top three. Tiasco Hernandez, uh, O'Neal, and Sinsu Chu, and Domingo Santana. Those are my top. Those are the top budget cards for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. 
the gold ones that I mentioned are amazing cards. They're so cheap, man. If you have like 5k stubs, go pick them up. And honestly, guys, that's all I got for you today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please be sure to like and subscribe. I'm sorry for raging in the video. My mom was being annoying, but anyways, uh, that's all I got. Peace out, everyone.